Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to unbox a, um, a grill that I purchased for the boat. Um, it's a Kuma Elite um, model 216, I believe I, it is. Yes, it is a 216. Um, I tried, I, I was going to order a Magna grill because it was, it's like a popular grill. Um, but after looking carefully to like pictures and um, comments online, I realized that the grill does not close on the side or in the front so a lot of people were complaining complaining that it would rattle on you know when you're out on the water so the kuma elite 216 i saw had two little clips on the side and um, i'm excited about it i have it here i'm going to unbox it so um let's go and do it I also bought a grill tray. I have a grill cover. This is the grill mount um, for the railings, just in case I go that route. And then I went for the pedestal as well, um, which I'm really excited and I hope it works out. Um, the only reason why I got the mount as well is just um, in case this didn't work or, you know, hey, I have them both. so. All right, let's um, get to unboxing this and see what we have. Let's do this. All right, so we have the 216 Elite Model Kuma. Um, this looks shiny as heck. Um, and it has the latches. This is what I was looking for. So let's see how we get it out of this box. All right, so far so good. Lots of packaging, always a plus. Yeah, upside down, but that's alright. Let's just be careful with it. It's got some weight to it. I hope it can keep it shine because this is gorgeous. Ah, this is nice. You guys could see that. Awesome. Cool, cool. Open that. The latches are nice in there. Instructions. Set that up. Cool. Well, it looks like a lot of space in here. I mean, we're on the boat. So this is a lot. I could put one, two, three, four, five, six burgers on this. This looks like it comes off to be clean. This, unfortunately, I know won't stay like this. That's gorgeous and beautiful. But it looks like everything comes out. Everything comes out to clean, and that's all I'm interested in. Make sure it's nice and clean. This goes back. This is nice. Latch this bad boy back in there. Latch this in there. Give you a look what it looks like. It's really nice. You're about 16 inches wide. This is awesome. 16 and it's about 10 inches tall. Hmm, this is very nice. All right, so let's open the other pieces. I'm gonna set this aside. This is the grill tray. So that comes out and extends it for a little bit more room. That's cool. Oh, it's small. <laughs> that is cool. It goes a little something like these. This looks like 
it just steps over the last one. Something like this. Oh, cool. That's very, very nice. This thing's sturdy. I'm glad I'm banging it around just to see. I think I'm going to install this tomorrow. Have some burgers on the boat. Here's what the grill cover. Reason why I purchased this grill cover was um, I want to cover it, obviously. And then I want to take it with me. Um, I definitely don't want to leave it on the boat. Not because I don't trust anybody, but with all the birds out there, they'll have a field day just chilling out on this bag and the, uh, ruin it. You saw me do that. That was easy. I'll just center it. Center it. Yep. Look at that. That is amazing. Cool. And I could just take it to the boat. Boom. Undo it, take it out, and I'm good to go. This has plenty of room in here too that I, I could even put a bottle in here. But uh, maybe I don't want that hitting the grill, damaging it. Because I'm going to try to keep it as shiny as possible. Alright, so this is the mount. This is the rail mount. So. So, they give you a little Allen key. All right. So I could see that the railing right here, the square bar rail, will go right here. And this will hold on to the rail. This was the rail like this, and then stick out. The grill fits itself here. Maybe something like this. There you go. That looks about right. The grill goes like this, and you screw the bottom into the grill which could be a, I mean, it's easy, but we'll figure it out. If that's not the way to go, I'll just put this back because I'm not sure what I'm using. Cool. Next and last item for it is the pedestal grill mount. You can totally do this, no problem. Couple of screws. So this goes like that. This goes like this. And it kind of like does a twist. Well, maybe this is supposed to be like released. There you go. And it does a twist. This is like one of my tape. Yeah. I have a table on the boat that's like that. So you go like this. Boom. Lock it in. Let me see. There you go. Boom. Twist it, it's got to be flush mount to the floor, twist it, and then lock it. Oh, it tells you here, lock, unlock. Cool, cool, very cool. So here, so this bad boy is in there. Alright guys, that was the unboxing of the Kuma 216 Elite Model Grill for the boat. Um, for any boat, doesn't have to be a pontoon. Um, so I hope that you like this. I hope that when you see this and you thought it was pretty cool, you get one yourself. Um, 
So let's go try it out on the boat and see um, how this bad boy works out. Man, looking at that food, I'm getting hungry. All right, talk to you guys later.